What's going on, y'all? You are on Talk It Issue with Chris podcast. So today I was going through my Instagram and I was trying to figure out like why, you know, is Little Nas X trending again? Like what's going on? And so when I saw the picture, I was like, is he pregnant? I was like, what's going on? Is he actually a trans man? And we didn't know it. Like I thought he, you know, maybe we thought he was a cisgender man and, you know, come to find out like, oh, He's actually trans and stuff, but then when I kind of did a little more digging and realized, like, oh, okay, he he has an album coming out, his Montero album, which is crazy because for some reason I just thought his Montero album was already out for some reason. I don't know why, but I don't really follow him like that. But um, I was trying to figure out to my, like, like, you know, why, well, why would he pick, you know, to do something like this? And so he said he was listening to Meg Thee Stallion's verse on his new album, Montero and they have um, Meg Thee Stallion and Little Nas X have a song out called Dollar Sign Slime and so he said he was listening to it for the first time and and he was like oh my god this is amazing so he immediately called his stylist and said um, wow all of this is coming together for your album it's your baby he was like yeah this is my baby huh as a joke and she was like yeah you should do a pregnancy shoot and he was like, you know what? That's actually brilliant. So now they did the whole entire thing coming out um, like as if, you know, he's about to have a baby for the album when it drops, which I think is pretty smart. Um, in today's world and the way how things go, how so many crazy things are going on in the world and people post some of the craziest stuff, um, people doing the crate challenge and losing their life and breaking their neck. Why not? I mean, hey, shit. If you want to act like you having your your album is the baby and you about to push it out on the seventeenth, I say go ahead and do it. I mean, I see the creativity in it. Um, I see the joke and the playfulness in it. Um, I don't think it's hurt nobody or hurt nobody's feelings or nothing like that. Um, a lot of people say that their projects are their baby, whether it's in film and TV, uh, music. Um, you know, personal projects that people are doing, whether it's paintings or, you know, fixing up, you know, old houses and stuff and, you know, refurbishing them, you know, whatever it is. Lots of people have different projects that are their babies. So I say, hey, why not? You know, I mean, with this gender fluid and with everybody just, um, you know, pl- dabbling in the femininity, I think it's and I don't know. I think it's nothing wrong with that. You know, hey, I I see the creativity. I think some people need to calm down and stop letting um, social media, you know, play with your emotions and get you all riled up and stuff. This is for your entertainment and for your enjoyment. That's why you get on social media, correct? Amen. So therefore, you need to stop getting offended all the time about you know with stuff. Oh well, the kids, you know, well the kids shouldn't be on there, and you as a parent shouldn't be a lazy motherfucker and should be monitoring what they're consuming. Now, if you don't like what's being shown, there's so many other things that your children can watch, and you can stop them from watching that. So that's on you and your parenting. But um, I say, hey, go ahead, do it. I don't need much to add to it. Um, I say. It's probably going to probably go platinum, double platinum and stuff. So people, these kids like it. It's different. And um, in today's world, you guys got to think about it, too. It's So many things have already been done. So you really do have to think outside the box. I mean, even me doing my podcast and the things that I say and the stories that I tell, I'm always trying to tell different stories that you don't hear or you don't. Maybe everybody's not touching this or whatever. I try to figure out what is going to make me different out of everybody that's kind of doing the same thing I'm doing within, whether it be podcasts, YouTube, any of that kind of stuff. It's like, you know, so I was looking at it from little Nas X standpoint, like what hasn't been done, what, and the stuff he's been doing hasn't been done and it's pushing the envelope, you know what I mean? And, you know, I'm here for it, you know, 
I mean, this ain't nothing I knew. I ain't never seen before. So, you know, hey, but everybody ain't been exposed to everything like I have. So uh, that's all I have to say about that. So comment and subscribe. You guys know how to find me on Talking to Your Chris podcast, uh, Apple podcast, Spotify, Google, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, all that. All uh, Talking to Your Chris, same thing with Snapchat as well. And remember, every week I'm dropping episodes and sometimes two episodes a week. So make sure you guys are subscribing and rating me five stars and keeping your notifications on so that when every time I drop, you know i am uh, got something to talk about. All right. Talk to you guys later. Bye.